Welcome back, Knights. This is Night Vision News, bringing you the latest stories on August 19th, 2024. Good afternoon, Knights. Thank you for joining us this Monday. Homecoming is officially on its way. Knights, get ready to throw on your astronaut gear and build your spaceships. The theme this year is Knights Take on the Universe. On September 17th, the festivities will start strong with the homecoming parade. If you'd like to sign up for this, please scan the QR code on screen or visit the official Stuco Instagram account. Forms are due September 9th. Speaking of homecoming shenanigans, tickets are officially going on sale Wednesday, but wait, that's only for seniors. On Wednesday, it will be the senior sale starting at $35. Then on Thursday, everyone else may begin purchasing tickets that also start at $35. Knights, make sure you buy them ASAP. They sell out fast, and for every day you forget to bring money, they get more expensive. Knights, a new school year can be overwhelming. If you're feeling sad, anxious, or having hurtful thoughts, know that there is help. You may also have noticed that some of your friends are having a hard time lately with stress, and you are wanting to help. Share these resources for the National Suicide Hotline, the El Paso Crisis Line, the Text Crisis Line, and Speak Up YSD. For Speak Up YSD, you can reach out by emailing speakup at ysd.net, texting 915-237-9013, or even leaving a voice message anytime. And yes, it's 100% private. No one has to know that you shared this. The link and phone numbers to these resources will be in the description of this video. Stay safe, Knights, and remember, you are loved. Do you find yourself struggling to really grasp certain tops, concepts, or maybe just confused on a tiny part of your curriculum? Consider stopping by after school tutoring. It's open to all students and all subjects from 4.10 to 5 p.m. It's in room 214 and is open from Monday to Thursday. Don't be shy. It's time for sports. Over the weekend, volleyball had a lot of games to play in their tournament. They lost some and won some, which ended up contributing to an overall win-to-loss ratio of 2-8. to eight. Their next game will be tomorrow. It will be here in our courts versus Jefferson. On Saturday, our night runners woke up feeling determined. Our boys and girls teams both got second with Zarak Hernandez and Elizabeth Aguida contributing the most. Congrats, Knights. Way to work. Their next race is this Friday at the Eastside Sports Complex, so make sure to wish your cross friends lots of luck. And before we end today's broadcast nights, we would like to share Fabian Salas, a very happy belated birthday. Yay! We at Night Vision hope you have a had awesome birthday, spent with, spent with fun time with your family and friends. And that's all we have for today nights. Don't forget to follow the KVN YouTube channel X and TikTok accounts so you can catch all the latest scoops. This has been lead anchor Jessica Hill for Night Vision News. Don't get lost on the way to class.